policy ordering. This is Excuse that. dinner with the devil. <laughs> and it's satanic. Mm -hmm. Now, there is a great poet among us. His name is Bienvenido Bones Banners. And he wrote the satanic verses. And we have a copy of that here. We'll pass that around later. So you can see the beautiful artwork he did to illustrate his poetry. But this comes in 12 books. And I'm only going to read one short book. And you will see what it's about. It's a very apt commentary on this world we live in today. And beautifully said. And here we are, book seven. It is a serious thing to live in a society of possible gods and goddesses. To remember that the dullest and most uninteresting person you talk to may one day be a creature which, if you saw it now, you would be strongly tempted to worship, or else a horror and a corruption, such as you now meet, if at all, only in a nightmare. That is a quotation from C.S. Lewis, The Weight of Glory. And now here is what Bien has said. The wise rulers, Euro-Asian American, the co-prosperity sphere, democracies, a fiction, not by many elected, by Satan. I know the rights by which they rule. The world is made of numbers. Pythagoras knew, Father Guru. I know their numbers and their shape. The Pentagon, Satan's star, ruled we are, not from among our own, but by the ever unchanging high order of that satanic club, the enlightened ones. To do good, they say, and no marvel, for Satan himself is transformed into an angel of light. Therefore, it is no great thing if, he, if his ministers be transformed as ministers of righteousness. They will perform wonderful works for humanity and feed us milk and honey, but it will be bitter in our mouths. Like that little book of John, the number of the beast is a number of a man, and his number is 666. Understand one thing. The kingdom under the Antichrist, more glorious than any earthly kingdom, the height of man's endeavor and achievement, all will welcome it and abide by its benevolent rules. My further revelations are here have been banned by those who fear. The mighty men who rule would not approve. The march of freedom and democracy and truth is but a dumb heap of dreams. Yes, wonderful works for humanity. And feed us milk and honey, bitter in our mouths. For you are the numbers by which the beast rules. By the numbers of the mortgages you hold and must repay. By the numbers of the interest rate under which you groan hangs from one golden thread of one great thing, that when a man owns, he wants more, always more, and will borrow for a dream of future happiness, and then will slave until his dying day to repay. The beast. How many men to mine? How many men to build? A throne for Satan? A tower above God Himself? How many hands? How many minds? Salaried all. But the beast gets that back in interest. Numbers all. Fractals of the beast's geometry. And should one number fail, a number, a number will replace. You are numbers all. And Welcome, welcome. Bienvenido, Bosman, as in Peter Joseph. 